I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw adjectives. Up here at the top I'm going to put an adjective. An adjective is a word that describes a noun. Describes a noun. Okay. First thing we have to do is draw our tic-tac-toe grid. Straight line down on the left, straight line down on the right. Come back to the left, straight line across. One more time, straight line across. This box up here, I'm going to label sound. That's for a sound adjective. The next box, feels. And this top last, taste. And you'll understand once we go through them. Next down here will be color. Next to that will be smells. Next to that will be looks. And now on the bottom, size. How many and behavior. Now these all sound kind of strange, but you'll understand once we start filling them in. Okay, so come up here and on sound, we're going to put a dot and we're going to draw a circle. And we're going to come on the right hand side, curve line up and connect, jump over, curve line out and connect on the left. Come inside and mimic that again, curve line, straight line left and right. Inside, one dot, two dots, flat oval, curve line to the left, curve line to the right, little curve line in the center. One, two straight lines, one, two, three straight lines. I'm going to color this part in right now because that is my open mouth for my mouse. And what is my mouse doing? My mouse is squeaky. It is a squeaky mouse. The adjective is squeaky. The noun is mouse. Squeaky describes the mouse. So now I know by sound I have a squeaky mouse. Come over to fields. Put a dot. Curve line up, curve line up again, come right next to it, curve line up, curve line down, connect. Come back over here to the dot, curve line in, curve line out, straight line, come up to the top, curve line up, one, two, three little curve lines and connect. Come on the inside, curve line, curve line down, connect. Come on this side and let's just do straight diagonal down and a dot. Come back right here and put a little curve line up. This is my bunny. And how does my bunny feel? My bunny feels soft. Soft bunny. This soft is the adjective. Bunny is the noun. Let's go over to taste. Put a dot. Straight diagonal down, straight line over, straight diagonal up, leave it floating. Come back to the left, curve line, curve line, curve line, curve line, connect. Straight line, straight line, straight line, straight line, straight line, connect. Come up above, curve line, curve line, curve line. Curve line, curve line, little curve line, connect. This is taste. This is my cupcake. Cupcake is my noun. How does my cupcake taste? 
It's very sugary. Sugary cupcake. That describes the taste. Now come over here, put a dot, circle, straight line down, curve line, straight line down, connect, curve line out, in on the left, curve line out, in on the right. Little straight line on top. Wavy, wavy line, jump over, wavy, wavy, line connect, come up to the top, wavy, wavy line, jump over, wavy, wavy line, connect. Dot, dot, curve line, and now zigzag, zigzag, leave it floating. This, we can't fill in yet because we haven't done our color, but it is, my noun is hair. He's got a lot of hair, and I'm going to color it green. That will be the color. Not yet, but coming up. Next, box smells. Put a dot, big curve line up, over, straight line back, connect. We're going to put little curve line, little curve line, little curve line, little curve line, wavy line, wavy line, connect, wavy line, connect, wavy line. Dot, 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 dot. 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 My noun is taco. How does my taco smell? It smells yummy. A yummy taco. Yum. Smells. Okay. Next, come over here and put a dot. Wavy, wavy line. Connect. Straight line, curve line. Straight line, connect. On the right. Straight line, curve line, straight line, connect. Big flat oval, dot, dot. Big curve line, little curve line, little curve line. Straight diagonal up, back, straight diagonal up, back. Wavy, wavy line on the left, wavy line on the right. Wavy line up, back on the right, wavy line up, back on the left. What is this? How does this look? This is my monster. And how does he look? Spooky. Spooky monster. Monster is the noun. Now come down over here for size. Put a dot. Big curve line up. Curve line in. Out. Leave it floating. Come back to the dot. Big curve line up, connect. Right here, curve line, little curve line, dot, come up on top, curve line out, up, out, up, connect. This, my noun, is a whale. How big size? It's gigantic. A gigantic whale. Really big. Next box, how many? One, two, three baby circles. Wavy, 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 connect. Wavy, 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 connect. Wavy, 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 connect. I have three flowers. Flowers is the noun, the adjective, three. Last one, behavior. <clears throat> Put a dot, baby circle, straight line, curve line, straight line, connect, curve line out, in, on the right, curve line out, in, on the left, little curve line on top, straight line, straight line, connect, dot, dot, little curve line. Big curve line up, little curve line, little curve line, big curve line back. And I'm going to fill this in right now so I do not forget. Okay, and then a little wavy line on the right, little wavy line on the left. This is a baby. What is the behavior? How is that baby acting? That baby is 
laughing. A laughing baby. Okay, so an adjective is a word that describes the noun. Let's see how we're going to color these in. Okay, we've talked about this before. When you have a chart, you don't really want to color a lot of it because you want to make sure you can still read it. So I'm just going to color the inside parts of that mouse pink, my bunny pink. I'm going to add some pink sprinkles on my sugary cupcake. And I'm going to come all the way down and color in this laughing baby pink. Okay? Next, I'm going to take tan, color in my mouse, my squeaky mouse. It could be an icky mouse. It could be a brown mouse. But this is sound, so he's a squeaky mouse. I'm going to come down and color in my yummy taco tan. Then I'm going to add some green sprinkles to my sugary cupcake. Now I can draw in my green hair. I don't know why I chose green, but I did, including his mustache. It's all green. That's the color of his noun, the hair. Okay, now I can add some green lettuce to my taco. And I can come in with some tomato, red tomato. Tomato is the noun, red is the color. And I'm going to give my spooky monster a red nose. Give my mouse a black nose. Okay. I'm going to use gray for my gigantic whale size. He's huge, humongous, biggest, gigantic. A little blue up here for his spout. Okay. Let's do my flowers, my three flowers, blue. Okay. Let's give my baby a blue bow. My laughing baby a blue bow. And let's have some yellow flowers. One, two, three yellow flowers, yellow cupcake bottom over here. Okay, purple monster. Don't kill your label, looks. He doesn't look spooky though, does he? Looks a little happy. He's a happy monster, but that's a different adjective, and you can use that later. Okay. Let me see if that's all. Looks like it's all, but you know how I am. Sometimes I forget. All right. Let's see what this looks like all colored in. Okay. Here is my adjective chart all colored in. It would be fun for you to try and figure out a noun and an adjective that would fill in your own boxes. Okay, bye-bye.